the September 21st governorship elections. The campaign train of the APC candidate Senator Monde Okwebolo and his running mates, Honorable Dennis Ijahosa, have continued to gain more momentum as more prominent grassroots support groups such as the ASAN Republic in Benin City are the latest to throw their weights behind the Edo Central Speaker. The occasion of the endorsement, which took place in the state capital, was attended by key representatives of the ASAN group, such as former Edo State House of Assembly Speaker, Honorable Dr. Justin Okonobo, and others. BTV News Best Orator has more on the story. The warm reception accorded to the campaign train of Senator Mondi Okwebolo, as demonstrated in this gathering, has become a regular feature everywhere in Edo State as they made their campaign visitations from one place to the other. Here, members of the ASAN Republic Nigeria, a coalition of Edo groups for growth, development and progress in Edo State, came together to endorse the APC governorship candidate, Senator Mondi Okwebolo, for the number one seat at Osadebe Avenue ahead of the September 21 polls in Edo State. In their separate remarks, Executive members of the ASAN Group Coalition, Honorable Johnson Okonobo, the former Speaker of the State House of Assembly and Professor Okoji, stated that the ASAN Republic, which is made up of over 20 groups and affiliates, have unanimously agreed to give their full endorsement to Senator Monday Okwebolo, a bona fide ASAN son, and also his running mate, Honorable Dennis Idahosa, as Governor and Deputy Governor, respectively. The high point of the endorsement ceremony was the decorative dressing of Senator Mondi Okwebolo in traditional ASA regalia and the presentation of a beautiful birthday card as a belated gift from the ASA group coalition. <laughs> Responding, APC gubernatorial candidate Senator Mondi Okwewolo, also known as Akpako Miza, who was full of joy and appreciation, addressed the people in his native Esa language and assured them that by God's grace, he would not disappoint Edo people when elected into office. <laughs> In his address, former Governor of Edo State, who is paired in the APC campaign, Senator Comrade Adams Eric Ushamle stated that the endorsement of Senator Mondio Pueblo by the ASAN Republic Group have shown that there is no minority language or people before God. He added that it is vital that a governor should understand his language in order to reach out to his people. In our quest for the unity of our state, in the eyes of God, there is no minority. So, yeah. oh, yeah. we've agreed that let this, let this next governor come from in separate interviews, Honorable Dr. Justin Okonobu, a former speaker of the Edo State House of Assembly, Professor Okoji, a prominent academia, and Dr. Mrs. Marian Jubrin, a Nissan Group coalition chieftain, stated that they are happy as a people to endorse a full blood Nissan man, Senator Mondio Pueblo, as governor of Edo State, as they believe in him to deliver the dividends of democracy to the people. We have gathered here today to endorse him and let the other tribes know, because they are supporting us, that this is the one we sent. Senator Monde Okpaiwolo. Senator Monde Okpaiwolo is the one his tribe, his own people, have sent to represent them in the state as governor. Come September 21st, 2024. The ASAM Nation, we are here today to endorse distinguished Senator Monde Okpaiwolo as our sole candidate for September 21st governorship election in Edo State. A man that knows his roots right from his growing days to this point. So it's who you know that you can send message. So he's the chosen one to be sent to Sadebe Avenue to represent the Ace Foundation. Simple as that. We are here to celebrate our son. Madok Bawe Keak Bakomiza. 
that God has given mandate to carry a dose state forward. These are the essence. Essence in Benin, we have come together to endorse our own. So let him know that we are solidly behind him. Other members of the ASAN Group Coalition and its affiliate, Mr. Ken Idemudia, and others in an interview said that they are endorsing Senator Mondo Pueblo because he's a man with an amazing personality, one whom they truly know as a homeboy and one they believe will bring development to Edo State. Also, the Vice Chairman of Edo State Commercial Drivers Union, Dikin Inegbini Jason, also added that they are giving their support to Senator Okwavalu because of the current overtaxation and oppression they are experiencing under the current administration of Obaseki. I believe the next governor of Edo State should be an Esa man. Having said that, not just an Esa man, an Esa man that knows what it takes as an Esa man. The reason why we are adopting it today is because of a track record. That is why we are bringing Mondo Okwavalu who know the way they kill rabbit in the farm. You know, as a governor, if we, if we vote him as a governor, he will know what he's trying to do for the Edo people. We are here to support our aspirant, Mondo Okbebo, a.k.a. Akba Komeza. We see him as a man who will turn this state around for good. The Senator Mondo Okbebo campaign continues to get a wide acceptance among the people. Best orator reporting for BTV News.